Okay, now I'm going to open up the hole with a 716 uh, drill bit and uh, uh, it seems like it's going to be okay. The belt is jumping a little bit and the job is Yeah, a few teething problems. That's not bad. That's good. Yeah, it's still cutting on one flute. But that's okay. I can I can always sharpen up the drill bit later on. Yeah. It's, it's cutting okay. Certainly needs the cutting oil, but that's quite a that's a fair sized drill bit from a quarter up to seven sixteen. And that's doing nicely. Yeah, it's going to be, it's going to work good. See, as soon as it gets a bit dry, it wants to kick on the motor. I'll have to do something about that later. But this, this is what's happening now, as you get into the stage where we're having a lot of teething issues. Um, it looks like it's, it's cutting nice. And the, the motor's not slowing down very much. In fact, the motor's pretty good. So, it's going to be a nice addition. I think I'm breaking through. No. So now I'm 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 actually drilling 716 because I've. I've finished, I've reached the the end of the quarter inch drill and now I'm continuing to drill and that's 716 and that's cutting really good I'm very pleased with that doing things like this means that there's less boring and machining and now I don't have to worry about the the carriage being in the way, I can go right over the top of the carriage. So that's pretty good. I'm very happy with that. There we go. Just a case of sharpening the drill bits. So they cut on both flutes. And then it'll cut even better, I think. I'm gonna go right the way through. It's only a short piece of old aluminium. So I should be able to drill at least three inches deep now and I can get as close as possible up to the face of the of the hole that needs to be drilled so that's another plus and then I can drill quite deep if I want um, what speed do I have it on? I got it running at 40 rpm No, 400, sorry. Yeah, 400. That's 400 RPM on a 716 hole. Takes a bit of leverage on the 
on the pinion but with a longer bar in a in the disc that'll make it much easier I guess the next thing I'll have to check is running stuff between centers through because I might drill into my spindle so okay I'm gonna leave it at that